Now along on this adventure today is myself, Jeff Gailey, named of course, the Sea Dog. Jim Schlegel, in his first... It's nice the last week or so, the lake is nice and calm, the water is crystal clear. We're just setting lines here, getting everything in the water. You want to come right to the middle of the board and get this rod out of your way. Right over here. It was jumping over there before, but he's not jumping right now. There you go. Got it. Well, do you remember those days when minutes seem like hours? But you're not about to give up because you're surrounded by your peers and you want to impress the old guys, even though everything that is old to them is brand new to you. Remember, it's about making memories in the great outdoors. One in the boat, yes sir. There, good. were joined the following morning by his wife Kim and it looks like Captain Jim and Troy well they did it again Steve Kim Houston and Lincoln filling the cooler and their freezer one more time what are you doing there with your king what are you doing there Nice rainbow. Oh my gosh. I wasn't there that morning, but in a matter of a couple of hours, it seemed like this crew just caught fish after fish after fish. And as you can see, it looked absolutely beautiful out there, and the water was as smooth as glass. Now there really isn't any better how or what you choose to fish for. It really is important to the future of the sport to help introduce kids and even adults to the outdoors. And no, it doesn't matter what you fish or hunt for or whatever legal means you choose to do it by. What matters is that you get outside and get them. Uh, we've had cohos, rainbow trout, and one nice Chinook salmon. Normally we catch a lot. you're asking yourself, now what did we do with all those fish? Well it just so happens that there's a squirrel we named of course the Sea Dog. This week's show 